It is a landmark and a well-known gathering place in Chicago, but it's been years since anyone has seen the Centennial Fountain in Streeterville running. So what's the deal? Our Tara Molina found out and she is bringing us the details from the fountain. It says temporarily closed, but three years isn't temporary. People who live around here and love this area aren't happy, and we've learned it will be years until that changes. Here's Centennial Fountain in all of its former glory. Built to commemorate the 100th anniversary of reversing the flow of the Chicago River. Mies van der Rohe's grandson, Dirk Lowen, commissioned to design it. We are welcoming arts from Lake Michigan into the river. But the beloved fountain. It is so beautiful when it is running. And arc, flowing and avoided by kayakers since 1989, came to a sudden halt in 2020. It hasn't been seen since. Turns out the mechanics broke down, leaving this entire area, well, empty. They just don't feel this is important. So three years later, why no fix? Streeterville locals like Gary Colasar. As important to a city as like art. This is the water cannon. And Gail Spreen have a real problem with this and the delay in fixing it. It's just totally unacceptable that it's been off this long. This should have been fixed within a year or two. It should have been working last year. They're among the number of residents behind this letter sent by Alderman Brendan Riley to the Metropolitan Water Reclamation District a full year year ago, asking why repairs weren't complete last year as promised. We reached out to them to ask about the holdup and learned they don't plan to have a fix in place for two more years. And that's the latest timeline, blaming, quote, supply chain issues. I lost it. Two more Chicago summers without this? That could be five years of it not running, and it's like some pumps and some electrical. They say, unacceptable. How much effort does it take to get two pumps? The hope continued pressure from those who love this area, love this fountain will expedite the fix. Reporting in Streeterville, I'm Tara Molina, CBS 2 News.